What is up, Hellions? And I'm sure you know exactly what you're looking at. There's a lot of Pikachu in the frame here, and that's because it's episode two of the chase for Chunkachu. Now, the chase for Chunkachu, if this is your first time here, basically what I'm doing is I am opening five vivid voltage packs every single week until we get the rainbow rare Pikachu. If you haven't yet watched episode one, you definitely should go back and watch episode one. Although, a little bit of a spoiler alert, it wasn't that great. <laughs> we, unfortunately, were not very lucky with our pulls in episode one. We got some decent, like, reverse hollow rares. The first five packs really just didn't get the adrenaline pumping, didn't get me going, didn't feel like I was getting lucky at all. So hopefully, uh, this week will be different. We'll be opening five more packs of the Vivid Voltage, one of each artwork, and then one artwork of my choice. And this week, I didn't do this last week, but this week, Pikachu, straight from Japan. I bought this while I was in Japan at the Tokyo Pokemon Center. He will be blessing every single pack. All right, guys, so here are our packs. I have a complete, well, 31 packs of a booster box here, and we are gonna be opening five today. Like I said, I'm going to be doing one of each artwork. So let's grab a Celebi, a Zarude. Uh, there's a lot of Celebi in here. Uh, Orbeetle, a Pikachu, here's a Pikachu. And this time, since we're hunting Pikachu, I think my extra artwork is going to be a Pikachu artwork. That just makes sense to me. Pikachu shows up in a Pikachu pack, right? I mean, that makes sense to me. It's just logical that he would show up in a Pikachu pack. All right, guys, as always, I will be giving away all the code cards here for the TCG to you when I pull them out of the pack. In return, please hit the like button and maybe comment below, what's your favorite pull that you've gotten out of Vivid Voltage so far? I would love to hear what you guys are pulling out of Vivid Voltage, if you've gotten the Rainbow Rare Pikachu yet or not. And yeah, I just want to get to know you guys. So type a comment down below, hit the like button. It really helps out the video. We're trying to get to a thousand subs and the best way to get there is with your support. So, all right, let's hop in our first pack. I think I'm just going to go straight to the Pikachu packs this time. I'm not going to save them for later like I did the Orbeetle last time. Oh, wait, I almost forgot. I almost didn't have Pikachu bless the pack. This pack will have a chunk of chew if you bless it, okay? Bless it. Ooh, okay. Hold on, we're just gonna bless them all while you're here. Beautiful, thank you very much. Here we go, starting with the Pikachu pack. I really like Vivid Voltage. I've been pull I've been uh, buying some Champions Path recently, and I gotta say, I like I like opening Vivid Voltage uh, way more than I do Champions Path. I know I know that's crazy probably to some of you guys to hear, but uh, it's just so much more fun to have a larger variety of cards and to know that even if you pull that nasty green code card, you still have. Uh, the ability to pull something cool. I think that is a, a really cool thing that they added to this particular set. Now, this card is a bit off center, so I'm hoping. That, I mean, I'm still hoping that it's something good, but uh, I hope it, I'm hoping that it's you know something good, but not necessarily something really good. <laughs> oh, I might have I might have snuck a peek at something. We might have some decent luck. You might have blessed the packs accordingly. Let's see, electric energy. That is a sign. That is a sign, you guys. An electric energy blessed by Pikachu. Oof, I don't know. Coating energy, all right, two energies. Shuckle, Delmise, Rock Ruff, Blitzel, Skiddo, Pharaoh Seed, Dedene. I love this artwork. He's such a little, like, claymated doll. He's, he's so he's so adorable looking, I don't know. Dedene is just, like, one of the cutest Pokemon ever made, in my opinion. All right, Reverse Hollow. Al Creamy, all right, that's a reverse rare. That's a reverse rare. That's pretty good. We pulled an Al Creamy in the other video, but we got this in the reverse slot, so that's even better because you can't, I don't think, get a hollow Al Creamy, so a reverse hollow Al Creamy is the best one that you're gonna pull. Last but not least, yo, Sarud V Full Art. Look at that. That is awesome. It is unfortunately quite off center, like we said before looking at it, but I don't have this card yet. That is super sick. We got a Zarude V Full Art. Let me get a sleeve for this bad boy. I love just the, the colors on this card. I think look really nice. You have the, the red, the black, the white, and the green. It's almost like Christmas color. Zarude V Full Art. That is very cool. Very cool. Makes me feel really good about the blessings that Pikachu has bestowed upon these packs. Now, should we stick with Pikachu? Or should we go to Celebi? Maybe we should save the other Pikachu pack for the end so that we can end on a good note. <laughs> All right, 
Oh, I might have snuck a peek. <laughs> I might have snuck a peek. That's my bad, guys. Oh, wait. Code card. Sorry. There we go. Boom, boom. I gave you the last code card, I think, right? Pretty sure. Four. Okay. Okay. I like the centering a lot more on this one. It's a little fat on the bottom, but you know what? Left to right is pretty solid. So if it's going to be something good, I would really, really appreciate uh, it being good on this one because that centering is pretty solid. All right. We have a water energy. Galvantula. Go Goats, Winden Stadium, Duskull, Barrow Seed, Riolu, Sandile, Reverse Hollow. Nope, not yet. Whalmer, Reverse Hollow. Electros, that's another Reverse Hollow Rare. That's our second Reverse Hollow Rare tonight. That is pretty awesome. We're going to get four rares in two packs. That is pretty sick. I like that. And our rare is Deancey. Okay, Deancey. All right, nice. I think I have this card already. But it's nice to get another hollow, so a double banger. Now, I know I said this in the first video, but I, I, I personally think, and I really hope we pull a couple of them in this box. Um, I seem to average about two a box uh, of the amazing rare cards um, in the Vivid Voltage set. I have to say, I think the amazing rare cards are probably my favorite cards um, Pokemon has probably ever made uh, that I have seen. I really like the amazing rare cards, so I would love to pull a couple amazing rare cards out of this uh pack as well one two three four all right this one again kind of fat on the bottom and the left but we'll see what kind of card it is hopefully it's something good but hopefully maybe not something really good <laughs> let's let's see now for you guys obviously i keep saying like all oh, the centering's off i hope it's something good but maybe not really good now I'm sending a lot of these cards out to PSA. I'm really hoping that a lot of these really good pulls are in really good condition so that maybe we get a chance at getting 10s um, because I'm going to be doing videos later on when I get uh, my CGC. Sorry, I said PSA before. My CGC cards back, I'm going to be doing like CGC reveal videos and stuff so that you guys can see the conditions that I sent in and what they're being graded as from CGC. So I'm really hoping that a lot of these really good cards that we're pulling are going to be in really good condition. That's why I keep mentioning uh, the centering on the back and stuff like that. All right, Water, Matang, Mightyena, Beauty. We actually have a Beauty. We've pulled a Beauty Full Art uh, card before. It looks really nice. I really like that card a lot. Shuppet, Pharaoh Seed, Joltik, Sandile, Reverse, not yet. Reverse, Slugma. Uh, if I was po poker rand, I would say slug my balls. <laughs> and the rare is, yo, Colossal VMAX. Oh, ho, ho. now see, whenever I say, man, I really hope it's not something really good. All of a sudden it's something really good. <laughs> Colossal VMAX. I do not have this card yet either. Uh, nice, awesome pull. Another ultra rare and another full art, I think. I think this is uh, the, the Colossal VMAX full art card. Super, super cool. Uh, some very good pulls tonight. I'm very happy with how everything is uh, progressing tonight. It's 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 coming along. It's coming along really nice. We we even have two packs left. We even have two packs left. We're we're we've got some really really decent luck tonight. See, this is what happens. The first video, I don't bless. I don't bless the cards via. Japanese Pikachu. Uh, instead, we get one hollow trainer rare, and that is the best thing that we pull. Tonight, we bless him with the Japanese Pikachu, and holy crap, every single thing we've pulled so far has been really solid and uh, really, really fun. Ooh, let's, let's keep this up, though. Let's keep this up. Let's get an amazing rare next. I'm calling it. Let's get an amazing rare next that would be really awesome here is the code card for you guys an amazing rare would be oof, that would be fantastic i would love that one two three four all right i really like how the centering looks on this particular card so fingers crossed it's something really really good all right energy psychic stone energy shuckle ramorants c dot pick Mudbray, Joltik, Weedle, Loud Red. Okay, that is a uncommon. Exploud would be the rare. Um, but yeah, uncommon Loud Red, sweet. And our rare is 
a Metagross. I don't think I have. Well, I'm not sure. I may or may not have Metagross. I'm not. Oh, don't put him in the rare pile. I may or may not have Metagross uh, yet. Very cool Pokemon. I really like Metagross a lot. He's a pretty sweet Pokemon. So very cool. Very cool pull. All right. Not looking at the card. Not looking at the code card. Let's take this guy. Boom, boom. Code card for you. All right. One, two, three, four. Again, the centering is quite good on this guy. It's really good on this guy. Oh, please be something good. Please be something good. It seems like the uh, the centering on the regular rares is really good, and the centering right now on the full arts and the VMAX cards is kind of rough. So let's get that back on track, guys. Let's get that back on track where the centering is good on the on the important cards. Let's Let's get it back on track. We got the Metal Energy, we got the Opal, we got the Matang, Giraffe Rig. Did you know that <laughs> this is another one that is the same spelled forward as it is backward? It is a Pelindrome. Uh, I did not know that until fairly recently because I guess I just don't pay attention to that stuff. Whalmer, Weedle. Uh-oh, 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 spoilers. <laughs> Beldum, Fan P, Reverse Hollow, Jolteon. Hey, okay, okay. So in our first video, we pulled uh, a rare Jolteon, but hey, I will take a reverse holo Jolteon. That's the best Jolteon you can get in the set. So I love myself Jolteon. He is awesome. Uh, so let's uh, oof, let's see what we have next. What is our rare going to be? Oh. <laughs> I am haunted. I am haunted. We, we, we almost did 10 packs without seeing Trubbish or Garbodar. Ah! <laughs> if you guys don't know, if this is your first time here, Trubbish in uh, Champion's Path haunts me to my core. He's in every single one of my packs in Champion's Path. And uh, I knew he was in this set, but we hadn't pulled him yet. I was very happy. And we just pulled Garbodor. I'm not a huge fan. That, that is why I'm saying this. I'm not a huge fan of uh, Trubbish or Garbodor. They're probably my least favorite Pokemon. Um, probably the least creative Pokemon in my opinion. <laughs> Um, design wise they literally just took a bag of trash and made it into a Pokemon but yeah this is awesome you guys we pulled it two. we had two hits today uh, we had our Zerud V and our Colossal V Max unfortunately so I will say I am very happy that I got these pulls I did not have these cards prior to this but the centering unfortunately is quite off on um, both the cards the Colossal VMAX doesn't look too bad. It's a little bit heavy right to left. Um, maybe a little bit heavy. Yeah, top to bottom, just a little bit. It's not terrible, um, but it definitely, I don't think, would get a 10. Uh, same with the Zerud. It's a little bit heavy right to left and a little bit heavy bottom to top. You can definitely see it on the back. It's a bit thick on the bottom uh, and the left here compared to the opposite side. But I'm really glad I pulled these. I'm really glad that I get to add them to my binder. And I'm glad that we didn't get completely skunked in terms of hits like we did in the first video. I'm very, very happy with this. Very happy that we got those cards. Now let's go through quick. We got so many. We got a Reverse Hollow El Creamy Rare. We got a Reverse Hollow Electros Rare. We got a Reverse Hollow Jolteon Rare. And then we got a Reverse Hollow Loud Red and Slugma. So three Reverse Hollow Rares. And then on top of that, we got Garbodar, Metagross, Metagross, and Deancey rares. Out of five packs, we actually ended up with eight rares. <laughs> so that, that's pretty solid. I will take that. I will take that. And we got two big hits. So today was a success. And it was a success because I remembered to bless the packs with you, little man, with the Japanese Pikachu. I think he honestly blessed these packs and got us the hits and the eight rares in uh five packs thank you sir and thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it this was episode two the second week of the chase for chunkachu clearly we haven't found chunkachu yet but we did get some awesome cards that i do not have in my binder in my collection for vivid voltage yet and i'm very happy that we pulled these guys our luck is getting better it's increasing so hopefully next episode or the episode after we will see a Pikachu even if it's a Pikachu V I would be happy I just want I just want to see one Pikachu <laughs> so yeah thank you guys very much for watching if you enjoyed the video today please hit the like and subscribe button it really helps me out a lot and we're trying to hit the thousand subs on the channel I think I mentioned it already but 
that really helps me out able to monetize stuff able to get the community going a little bit better with the different features that youtube gives you after you reach that milestone so let's hit that like button leave a comment again on what your favorite poll out of vivid voltage has been so far we'll see you on the next video